My name is Hossein Arizo. I'm an Associate Professor of Systems Engineering. My current research is focused on state-of-the-art antenna technologies based on carbon nanotube and body wearable antenna systems, implantable medical devices, and indoor navigation for the visually impaired. Dr. Hussein Al Rizzo's research has great value to society and to his students. He is recognized as one of the world's leading experts in the areas of implantable medical devices for the treatment of epilepsy, body wearable wireless systems, carbon nanotube based sensors and antennas, and global positioning systems to aid the visually impaired. His students recognize him as a generous teacher who values their research as much as his own. Dr. Al Rizzo received several patents and authored 33 peer-reviewed journal papers and 48 conference publications. My name is Greg Barrett, Associate Professor of Higher Education. My research interests lie in um, minority issues and collaborating with my doctoral students. Dr. Gregory Barrett has extended his research agenda to ensure that his students will also conduct research. He has made a commitment to guide them through the world of national research and policy and to co-publish with them for three years after graduation. His mentorship not only strengthens his students' careers, it also helps boost the number of doctoral students in the state. Over the past seven years, Dr. Barrett has published six articles in prestigious education journals. Two others are currently being reviewed. I'm Teresa Biner, the Nadine H. Baum Distinguished Professor of Law. I make sure the federal courts protect your civil rights. Professor Teresa Biner is known for her thoughtful articles on timely topics. Her thinking is routinely ahead of the curve as she explores topics including the current state of the legal profession, diversity in the judiciary, and sexy dressing as an invitation to sexual harassment. Professor Biner brings depth to her research by combining first-class legal analysis with cutting-edge social science data. Over the past five years, she has produced 10 major publications, and more than 230 citations to her articles have appeared in law reviews. I'm Eric R. Kaufman, a professor in the Department of Mathematics and Statistics. My research areas are ordinary differential equations, dynamic systems on time scales, and fractional differential equations. Dr. Eric Kaufman's work is well known and highly regarded. His early research in the area of fractional derivatives is particularly relevant now that the field is enjoying renewed interest. His research also casts a wide net. He has been cited 98 times by 76 authors and has published 34 articles and participated in 42 invited or contributed presentations over the past 15 years. Dr. Kaufman serves as a referee for 20 journals and is a reviewer for two of the three reviewing and abstracting services in the world. My name is Hong Guan Kim and I'm Associate Professor of Management Department and my research area is in building knowledge modeling and methodology. Dr. Sun Guan Kim has an impressive research track. 13 publications in the past five years including five journal articles, seven conference proceedings and a book chapter. He is developing new methods for creating knowledge models that would provide an efficient way for analyzing the knowledge and knowledge flows required to complete business processes. These new methodologies are more reliable and easier to use, and colleagues say Dr. Kim's practical and groundbreaking work will bring international prestige to UALR. I'm Moira McGuire, an assistant professor of history. Through my research, people are able to find their history. Dr. Moira McGuire has opened a door to the past to shed light on the plight of Irish children given up for adoption in the 20th century. Using records that have been overlooked by other scholars, she has helped to reunite families and heal long dormant scars of memory and experience. Dr. McGuire's forthcoming book, Precarious Childhood in the Post-Independent Ireland, gives voice to ordinary people who have long been ignored in the historical record and offers a glimpse into the past that is long overdue. I'm Dr. Avinash Thomre in the Department of Speech Communication at ULR and my area of research is Prospective Transformation and Cancer Survivorship. Dr. Avinash Tombre is engaged in cutting-edge health communication research that can improve the quality of life for survivors and help medical personnel gain a greater understanding of the recovery processes associated with terminal illness. 
He's helping prevent the spread of HIV AIDS through a global approach to evaluate the types of messages that resonate with different cultures and motivate health behavior change. Dr. Tombre also investigates transformational communication strategies to help cancer survivors make sense of the recovery process that has a profound impact on their quality of life.